It's Lisa with Talk with Lisa Psychotherapy in Illinois, and this is the Group Scoop. In another video, I explained how to use a Start, Stop, and Continue tool, and this is an example of a Start, Stop, and Continue involving a couple. So what Start, Stop, and Continue is, is what we should start doing that we are not doing, stop doing what isn't working well, and what we should continue that is already working well. You can use it with an individual. They can use it themselves to evaluate their progress and their goals as a couple um, or a friendship or a parent-child. It can be used in a work setting for teams. And then in my last video, my intro video, I talked about using it in the mental health setting. So here we go with a start, stop, and continue between a couple. And as a disclaimer, only six of these may or may not apply to me and my spouse. Start, start chewing less loud. Start exercising together twice a week with me. Maybe we should join the fitness factory in Carlisle and get fit. Start sharing the rights to who gets to pick the music in the car daily and on long drives. Start not saying you will be right back when I know you're going to the shed to work on your tractor and thus you will end up being gone all day so I can plan my day too. Stop cheating on me by watching our Netflix shows without me. Stop getting mad at me about something that you dreamed about that I did, that I didn't do. I did not cheat on you. Stop leaving toothpaste gloves in the sink. Stop leaving your nail clippings lying around. Stop eating my fries when you said you didn't want anything from insert fast food chain. Stop telling me the right way to fold. My therapist says it's not good for me to have perfectionistic standards. Continue. Continue being a good parent to our children. Continue entertaining discussions like what came first, the chicken or the egg, or what our apocalypse outfits might look like in the future. Continue not saying anything to me when I'm opening the window in winter in the middle of the night because I'm going through menopause because I'm not saying anything to you about burning us out with your fires. And continue cuddling with me and watching Netflix and doing date nights. Thank you.